Hi, this is Richard Byrne at freetechforteachers.com. In the previous video, we looked at how to create the basic place marks in My Maps offered by Google. In this video, we're going to take a look at how we can add place marks by importing data from a spreadsheet. So to get started here, we'll use the same map we were working on before, and we'll click Add Layer. And now we'll use the import function here in this new layer to pull in a spreadsheet from my Google Drive account. Uh, I have a spreadsheet here where I'd ask people for some information uh, about some of their favorite places that they've visited. And when I set up the spreadsheet, you can see here I have a column for name of the place, location. Um, so the name of the place and location might not be exactly the same. You see here we have St. Catherine's Church, but we see that it's in Dubuque, Iowa. I asked for some information for what makes that a happy memory for people, names, and then email addresses. Email address is totally optional. I asked for email addresses in this case for so that people who uh, responded to my questions could get a copy of the spreadsheet. So now I'm going to go back to my spreadsheet and I'm going to select that from my Google Drive account. And here I'm going to choose the columns to position my place marks on the map. So we need to choose a column that includes the location. Right? So there we go. We're going to include the location. Right? And now let's choose a title. So I'm going to choose name of the place. And finish. Now I could have selected in that second field uh, to include more information, but I didn't. Uh, I simply asked for location and names, and there we go. And so now we can see the information imported into the spreadsheet and displayed on the map for us. Now if we want to change the labels, we can go in and change the labels so that instead of using names, we can say... Uh, location as our as our key label there. We can change this style. So individual styles will allow me to use a different color for each place mark or any of the other icons that we want to use from earlier. So that's how we can import data into a spreadsheet from a spreadsheet into a map using Google's My Maps function.